What is up, people? Welcome back to another episode of All the Mods Expert. I hope everybody's doing all right. I'm doing pretty good, and I think my sound is low. <laughs> Maybe not. Okay, it's still, it's still, it's still okay. All right. So today we are. What, what are we exactly? I can't really see this thing. Let's come to the wall. We are a moon that is a skeleton. <laughs> So, yeah, guys, so I hope you enjoyed the last couple of episodes where we did a little bit more uh, automation in things. And like I said, I did automate uh, these machines here. If I show you over here, we have a couple of those ME interfaces. Uh, I also have one on this thing, simply because we needed at some point to have uh, buckets of water. So this is like perfect. You just send it in send it in and it goes straight back into the interface and this is where this is useful not just having the plate but having the full block because these can output on the same side that they input so you can input and output straight away into the block so it is pretty efficient uh, i've also done a lot of that hop uh HOP graphite, which if you remember, you need to like get coke dust and things like that. So we're pretty much re prepared to use it to do stuff. But first, we were doing something in thermal expansion uh, and we didn't finish because it turns out that we needed more machines. So I decided that it was the time to do them. Uh, so machine frame, I think, yeah, I did this. So I'm going to do six like so so we got five six there we go we're gonna need a magma crucible so what do we need for this uh no that's not well we'll need this one but the one i want is the magma crucible so i'll need one of these let's let's make like a couple so magma crucible bam we'll need a fluid transposer okay so we're in the need of making this oh that means we're gonna need more Floyd transposer and there's another one we need which is going to be the pulverizer uh, we need the redstone and I believe I made some of those cables the last time we were here they should be in here yeah there we go. we've got a couple of those that's perfect. So some people were talking, and I even talked about it myself, uh, that we pretty much needed to go and make um, a wireless terminal because, you know, well, it's important. Uh, wait, where is my magma? Oh, it's in here. I, I need it in my inventory, not away from it. All right, so pulverizer. There we go. We've got a pulverizer. There's a reason why we need a pulverizer, and it is because uh, to make a florbs, a florb, this thing, uh, you need to have sawdust and not wood pulp, which is made from uh, Ender IO. So because of that, I had a recipe in here that made wool pulp, but it's completely useless because. Uh, that's not the one we want so all right so where can we place these uh, I do believe that here will be a perfect spot these sadly cannot uh, be on the same block all right so let's put pulverizer uh, we're gonna go fluid transposer and the magma crucible above because if you don't know about these things uh, say it takes from the back I think no that's not the back that's the back oh wait you can do both now that's pretty cool all right so now that means I just need to pass oh wait we're, we're gonna put that one on the side just because it needs to take from this one to this one and we have a possibility to power it from the bottom so that no cables are visible so all right it's gonna take from the back and output to the left and this guy is going to take from the right and output to the back yeah that makes sense and this guy will do both to the back 
So just to test this out, what we're going to do... Oh, wait, we're, we're exactly where my cable passed. <laughs> okay, we're going to pass it some, uh, some power. So wait, this is the bottom? I thought this was the back. Oh, it seems it's the bottom. Uh, there we go. All right, there, perfect. So we're going to do this. Uh, I might just use the one that I have over there because I believe I still have... Yeah, I still have a lot of power over here, so I might just pass a cable all the way instead. Uh, but for the moment, we're just going to power it with what I have in my inventory. And of course, I don't have any conduits to power those. Conduit? Right. I still don't have a recipe, but I have like everything in a recipe to make the recipe. There we go. All right, so what we're gonna need now is to get some uh, wood. My wood, there you go. Oops, I didn't think that's the one I need. And we're gonna place that into a provolizer. It's pretty slow because it's not upgraded. The next step will be to upgrade it to an higher tier and placing some upgrades in there. But as you can see, it's not that bad. And one of these will give you eight pulp. So that's pretty easy to get. So what we're going to do is this thing. And there we go. Now we're going to have it. So with the pulp, now I can make this one. Perfect. Let's do this. Because we'll need two of those to fill in the other one. So now we're going to need, I think it's pyrotium dust to do this one. Pyrotium dust... Uh, Pyrotium dust. Let's grab some of it. Uh, how many do you need to make this? You need a thousand. And you make 250 per. So let's come here. We're going to put one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So that's going to go in there. It has a nice sound. It's like it's really bass intensive. Alright, so we got one. So now we're going to place our two fjords, or floor. I, I never know the correct pronunciation. The, it might be like a... The, the L is uh, like you don't pronounce the L, so it's forb. Or, you know, it's floor. Or, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so that should be a thousand. Wait, it's not doing it. Uh, there's glowstone. Let's see this one. Magnetic fuel. Maybe that's the... No, that's... I really hate that you can't see the recipe you're looking for. Blazing pyrotium. That's, that's what I'm doing. Oh, wait. This is just a fjord. I need a magnetic one. So how do I do this? Oh, it's a different recipe, I presume. Uh, oh, okay. Let's see. Magnetic fuel. Okay, so I don't know why I had this one then. But all right, we've got this going. So now we should be fine to put this in there. And there we go, we're going to have the material. That is one. That is two. So now we're going to be able to come back here and do induction smelter. Uh, no, wait, we, we needed this for that. Oh boy. Uh, this, this, what do we need? Copper. I thought I had a recipe for copper gear. Seems I don't. Unless it's not called copper gear. Not called copper gear. Alright, so let's do this. Bam, bam, and bam. We've got a compactor. So now to get the invar, you need one invar. So let's get invar. One, two. Really just need two, but you know. <laughs> when you can make one, why don't you make 700? That's how things work, right? 
All right, so again, this one, we'll do it like this. We'll put those two in there. I hope it's actually the right recipe. Mint. Oh, wait. Oh, that, that's press. But why did it say mint? Oh, because it needs an upgrade. Oh. Uh, so I need to upgrade this one. Get the the this uh, upgrade here. Oh wow! I need flux thingy. So that means I need to make an energetic infuser stuff. All right, we're we're still not there, guys. But it's okay. It's okay. That's that's fine. This thing needs to be Indian. So I need to go and make this thing. Oh, okay. Can I make some of those? I can't. So, all right. I think I'm gonna have to go kill a couple of Shubirin thingy doodler. These kind of thing. Uh, you can't have pretty much, I think, any of them. Uh, Azrod coin engraving. Hey, okay, wait. Queen. Uh, this thing. So you need, like, let's say this one. So Shogat. And an ender coin. So we're gonna have to make some of those. Life crystal? I can't do any of that. So, alright guys, let me make like a bunch of these things. Taxium. Yeah, we're, I'm, I'm gonna have to make some of that. Oblivion. That one I can do. Easily. I think we even have Oblivion. No? I thought we did. Is it in our bag? Is it in another bag? Like, you know the bag we, we had, but we, we don't use anymore? It's not in here. Hmm. Uh, let's say Oblivion. That That's the thing. I, I'm sure I had that. This contained incredible power. Yeah, did I? Oh, I use it for this. So, alright, we'll have to make another one, and then we'll have to make this. And this is going to be making a one stuff so we'll be able to use it with this this one will then be used to make one of these and we'll need four of those all right so i'm gonna get into crafting this and pretty much everything else so that we can get this and uh yeah so i will be right back And here you have it. I believe we should have everything. This was actually not that bad. Uh, I got lucky pretty much to the fact that these, like, you can make 10 out of one engraving. So I pretty much needed only one Etaxium. Because it uses the Oblivion Crystal to make that one Etaxium. So it's kind of expensive. Kind of expensive. But... That means that we can probably do some of those, or some of those. Could just do this. That would be easier. All right, so let's do this, let's do that. One, two, three, four. 
There's more recipes than I anticipated. Uh, what are they called? I never remember. They are called circuit board. Board. I can make one of those. I believe it's a correct one. I believe it accepts every circuit possible. Come on. Make it. Do it. Craft it. Build it. It's a, it's a new song from, uh, you know, who. There you go. Is it going to work? Yes, we've got a servo. Perfect. So let's do this. And a ban. New monastic blah 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 <laughs> so now we need to go back into thermal expansion and we need to build like one of those so we need a bronze gear i know there's another recipe people keep telling me all right so we've got this i believe this is gonna be working so let's take this thing bam and let's take this thing bam mint and I threw my two things away. So let's go, I think, what was it? Coin? It was not an iron coin, it was an Invar coin. Invar. Let's take two of these. Let's put them below here. And bam, so now it's gonna make the coin. And we only have one upgrade because we can't go any further for the moment, of course. There we go. Oh, wow, it makes three. Now that we've got the three, we can make the induction smelter. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, guys. The induction smelter. So that means that we can make those stupid things so that we can make... Because there's one more redstone furnace. <laughs> This thing needs hardened bronze, so let's make a hardened bronze. So we're gonna go with obsidian. One, two, three, four. And uh, let's let's just grab sixty-four and go bronze. And grab a little less. I think it's sixteen. It's one for four or something. So all right, let's do bam bam. Give me my stuff. Of course, these are going to take us uh, some upgrades. Uh, but to make the upgrades, like, at this point, you needed the Arden Signalum, so you needed this. So the furthest I could go was this one. So, but now, since we've got the good stuff, we can make more things. Alright, so, where's my redstone furnace? Oh, wait. Uh, machine? Hurt? The machine all right and what's the thing we need this thing perfect and there we have it a redstone furnace oh yeah I, I believe i'm just gonna get rid of this thing and move it somewhere else all right let's put some power let's put this thing here uh let's remove these uh, side thing so yeah, now we can actually make things. We can actually make things. And this is going to be useful. Uh, because like I said, th this thing is pretty much makes most of the things. It's a thing that makes most of the things, guys. So, yeah. I didn't know that you could make blazing parotium with it. But it seems you can. You need like, oh no, you need blazing parotium and it's going to like triple your ores. It's pretty cool. Uh, here we have a lot of sawdust. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever need it anymore. But uh, why not? We do have it. So yeah, of course I will have to automate these machines. Well, by automation I just mean connect them to the system. But uh, yeah, that, that's something we've seen and we've done and everything. Uh, but one thing I want to show you is this. Star. Oh yeah, six thousand stars oh yeah and this is pretty cool for the reason that well everything go through this so we can now make this thing and this is important because 
Well, first of all, let's do draconic evolution style. Okay, we need to make uh, the vibrant. Okay, I'm pretty sure I have a recipe, so let's make like 20. Wait. Can't click start for some reason. Can do one. Why did it tell me that I couldn't do more? Okay, 12. This, bam. Got a recipe for that. Let's take one. And now we can also make the recipe for this one. Oh, yeah. So that is what I'm talking about, guys. We're getting to Draconic Evolution. So let's see. Wyvern Core. Can I make like 12? It doesn't let me click it. It's that stupid Vibrant Crystal for some reason. Hi. There's nothing being crafted. It doesn't allow me to... It makes no sense. Where's the Vibrant Crystal? We're gonna move it like, I don't know, here. Okay. Uh, still doesn't allow me. Is it this one? Which one is it? Okay, let's see. Maybe it is this one. Again, we'll move it somewhere else. Okay, let's see. Core again. Still doesn't allow me. Okay, let, let's try to do Vibrant. This is allows me. This is allows me. This it doesn't allow me. Why? It doesn't allow me to make the vibrant crystal for some reason. Okay, let's redo the recipe. Maybe that's just an issue with the recipe. But it's pretty much the simple recipe. Put it here, maybe? Vibrant? Start! It doesn't let me. I don't know what to do, guys, here. Let's do this. Aha! I can, I can trick it into doing it if I... Like, let's say shift click. Oh, it's... No, it's not doing it. For some reason, this thing is creating an issue. As soon as it needs to craft this, it can't do that one. For some reason. Yeah, every time I can't. And it's not the bites, it's something else. It's ridiculous. Uh, do this. Uh, allowed substitution. So maybe. Uh, alloy. Uh, no, it's a uh, crystal. Crystal? It works! Okay, okay, so it was an issue with the nuggets? Let, let's see, we're gonna make 30. Nope, doesn't allow me. <laughs> I'm getting so annoyed right now. So, let, let me see, will I be able to remove it, place it back, and then craft it? It doesn't allow me. So, somehow I can't craft this. Uh, I will have to check because this makes freakingly no sense. It makes no sense at all. Why wouldn't you be able to do it? Let's see this, this recipe then. It's an alloy that makes nine. Uh, allow substitution? Yes. I'm gonna allow substitution for everything. Okay. Can you now do it? 
Crystal? It can't. So... I don't really know what to do here, guys. Uh... Is it maybe... Thinking it might have something to do with this here. Uh, where are my crystals and stuff like that? So, we've got this here. Because you know sometimes when you try to click, it doesn't put your things in there. And so maybe it's just not able to go grab your things somewhere in here and create the recipe. I don't know. I really don't. Uh, hmm. So I will have to check it out. But guys, that is actually going to be it for today. So I do hope you enjoyed the episode because that was a big boost. Having these machines, it's like incredible for me. Just having this one because it's super hard to make. But yeah, guys, if you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to leave a like. If you loved it, don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.